Alexa, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Need help getting going in the morning or a nudge to walk the dog? Ask me to set an alarm. Never be late for a date, even if it's just with your pup. Okay. Hey guys, what's up? Uh, <clears throat> it's the 25th, I think. Right? Maybe, maybe, so, so, I don't know. It could be, it could not be. I got a package. This is literally taped just completely all around it. There we go. Look at that. GoPro tripod mount. Not bad. Definitely worth the eight bucks. Now uh, let's give it a shot, see what it looks like. I just drove past like a really big ass RV and it kinda, you know, it makes me realize I would absolutely love to just take a couple months and literally just drive across the country in like an RV or something and just experience all the sights and all the cool things that our beautiful country has to offer. I mean, some of the stuff that I see with work is just amazing, but it'd be great to legitimately be able to just take the time to see cool stuff and just that be the only purpose of the trip. Taking a trip to Best Buy. So I'm trying to find like a, a point and shoot camera to do vlogging with instead of my iPhone. I primarily want something that actually has like image stabilization on it because uh, image stabilization is very, very nice. So I checked out, I'm sorry. I checked out Walmart and like the local Walmart and they had a, a, an okay selection. Just figured I'd come to Best Buy and check it out. Odds are, I mean, they must have, you know, a much larger selection than Walmart. Uh, I, I was wrong. The selection at Best Buy is actually worse than the selection at Walmart. So, uh, kudos to you, Walmart. Apparently, you have a better selection of point-and-shoot cameras. Go figure. So, I'm going back to Walmart and, uh, gonna pick up, uh, the one I think I want to try out. And I guess we'll see how it goes. So let's give this a shot again at Walmart. I picked up one of these things. Let's uh, let's see how well it works for me, I guess. So I'm like hella, hella, hella having second thoughts about this camera. I don't, I don't, I don't know. It's not that great. I don't like it. I'm very disappointed actually by a Canon product. But, you know, I, I feel like for $120, you know, it should be a little better than it is. I feel like I can get almost the same quality out of like a $60 camera, so. I'm heading back to return that camera. I'm really, really, really not happy with it. So, I'm just gonna bite the bullet, spend a little bit more money, get something a little nicer, and uh, hopefully I'll be happier in the long run. Literally, Every single camera that I want at Walmart is not in stock. So I'm going back to Best Buy. And I looked a couple things up online. I guess there's a couple decent cameras that are in stock there according to their website. So we'll see. But uh, it, I didn't realize it would be so hard to get a goddamn point and shoot camera. Like, what the fuck? All right, so... I'm actually happy. So I picked up a Sony Cybershot uh, DSC WX220. I was reading the box. Um, it was an open box item, actually. It's a nice little camera. Um, it, I guess it was missing like the, the battery dock charger thing for it and everything, but it does charge through USB, so that's not really an issue for me. Um, it was 116 bucks. Uh, instead of uh, 180 so um, it actually looks nice uh, the image stabilization on it looks good and hopefully it'll sound good I didn't bring an SD card with me I should have but um 
We'll give it a shot and see how it goes. I think it's gonna work out. I'm actually kind of happy. Sony's been really, really doing a great job with cameras lately. So well, we'll find out. I've driven 232 miles since Monday and it's Thursday. Great. So I'm testing out the new camera. It's a Sony um, Cyberchat SW220, I think. If that's not right, then I'll probably correct myself by putting some kind of text somewhere around my face or on my face. But uh, image stabilization seems good, video quality seems good, audio quality seems good, and the features in the menu seem freaking spectacular. So I think this one's a win. This thing is pretty nice. It like literally fits in the palm of my hand. It's nice and small. It's sleek and uh, I can't beat the price. I can't get over that I found a nice open box deal at Best Buy. That's great. I'm sitting here doing some editing and realizing that I'm not necessarily crazy happy with the audio quality of this camera. It's um, not really as good as the iPhone, but then again, I mean, the iPhone has an astonishingly good microphone. A lot of people don't realize how good the microphone in the iPhone is. Uh, <laughs> I've done some pretty cool stuff with it before. So, uh, I, you know, it's something that I'll, I'll deal with. Why not? I like the camera otherwise, so it's uh, it was worth it. It was, it was definitely worth it. And on that note, uh, bye.